As far, as far as Saudi regime and its allies are concerned, they had just admitted the last few days that they had committed, they had uh, committed up to 90,000 air raids against the Yemen. Majority of those air raids were against civilian targets, homes, mosques, hospitals, schools, anywhere where you can find maximum civilians, vulnerable civilians, such as sick people, children and women. The Saudis have been targeting them. Um, the figures, in terms of how many people dead in the country so far, two years of this war, we have over 15,000 people dead, civilians. We have over 50,000 people injured, seriously injured to the point of maiming. Um, there has been use of prohibited weapons such as cluster bombs and uh, uranium enriched bombs and other chemical bombs. We have recently received the first signs of birth defects as a result of use of prohibited weapons. The horrors are continuing. The UN humanitarian coordinator Stephen O'Brien for Yemen says that the situation in Yemen, the humanitarian situation in Yemen is worse than the World War II. I want you ladies and gentlemen to pause for a minute there. If something is worse than Hitler, what can it possibly be? Indeed, a Wahhabi regime that has been supplying terrorism to the world for good many years. According to US laws, just the laws, the Saudi regime is behind 9-11. And we all know that 9-11 is mother of all terrorism. Here in the UK, the last week, we have suffered yet another one of those attacks in the heart of our city, right outside of our own parliament. How long are we going to stand back and just support the Saudi regime is highly questionable. We really need to now stand up and stand in solidarity with the people of Yemen and say enough to this modern day Nazi regime that has nothing better to do with its money then kill small children and women and sick people in their hospitals. Ladies and gentlemen, I have one more shocking figure for you. Count this. UNICEF says a child under the age of five dies in the Yemen every 10 minutes as a result of the illegal blockade imposed on the Yemen by the Saudi regime. Now, if you are a little bit good with mathematics, this will give you a figure of up to 52,000 children per annum a year are dying because of an illegal blockade imposed on the Yemen by the Saudi regime and its allies. It is high time that we spoke and we said loudly to our own government that we can't continue to sell weapons to a regime that has been said to be worse than the Nazi regime.